Und herzlich willkommen zum 36. DocFest München. Mein Name ist Nora Muschüring, ich arbeite an der HFF München. Ich melde mich hier aus dem Silbersaal im Deutschen, Muse im Deutschen Theater. Und ich freue mich sehr, zwei Gäste begrüßen zu dürfen, deren Film The Personal Life of a Whole im internationalen Wettbewerb auf dem DocFest läuft. Es ist die deutsche Premiere des Films und ich freue mich jetzt sehr darauf, dass der Regisseur, das ist Andrei Wafreschka, Regie, und der, die Produzentin Alžbeta Janoschkova hier begrüßen zu dürfen, hier begrüßen zu dürfen. Um, hello, you two, hey. now I'm starting, hey. Um, I'm very, I'm very, very happy to have you here, um, because your film is one of my most um, favorite one, um, and um, we, are glad, we are very glad that, that you are that you are uh, in fan of this <laughs> um, And I'm, um, I'm personal. I'm very um, happy because I really loved it because it's in his form, in this experimental and playfulness of the film, and is in this essay form of the film. And um, I like this kind of film where where we think and see something and think while we're seeing something. So like this um, searching for something in a film and getting with you through this. And I have this imagine of a web when I first saw your movie, uh, your film. And now I'm, my first question is a very common question, but because there are a lot of topics, sure. The title says it's about holes, but it's also a lot of other issues in it. And where did you get the idea for the film and what was the first idea? For the film? Well, it started uh, very easily, you know, and it started uh, as the film is composed. Uh, it's half from the personal experience, half from the language, you know, mm -hmm. because I'm um, close to my place where I, where, where I live. There is a dam as a lake and uh, that that winter was very harsh. So it's uh, fr uh, frozen. Mm -hmm. And since on the uh, on the surface of the water there is a big hole you know f uh, it's a like um, it's a exit of the water of the of the dam and mm -hmm. i went there with my two friends it was very, very hard winter and uh, i just told them just to run around it like electrons you know uh, of the uh, on the close to the the, the nucleus of uh, atom And then we then, then then we went to the pub since uh, it was cold and we had a couple of beers, and my friend and she's French, she told me, "Tu bois comment tu?" which is like an idi idiomatic expression that uh, I drink a lot, which is not true, but uh, uh, I, I, uh, and it's, I had in my head the filming of the whole and this this idiomatic expression. I said, "Well, so we will do a film about the whole." So first was the hole. First there was a hole which I, which I liked very much on the on the lake, mm -hmm. and the friends which came and I filmed there, which as they are running there, and mm -hmm. then the pub and she said that to Baku Mantru you are drinking as a whole. I said okay, so we will do Connect. You know, montage thing, you know, so we will do the thing about holes, you know. Mm -hmm. So That's, yeah, so that was the starting point. Yeah, to get on the journey somehow mm -hmm. and. And you studied editing at the FAMO, isn't it? Yes, I studied uh, editing at FAMO. Then mm -hmm. I was studying, studying the Center of uh, Audiovisual Studies, which, mm -hmm. which is kind of like a new media cathedra. And then I studied uh, documentary directing in Moscow. And then okay. I studied linguistics and philosophy. And then you start, how do you get into the film? Into You have this hole as the first point, and then you going, because we see a lot of different kind of um, experts or of performant art in it or animals or something like that and it's a big web of a lot of pictures and it's also very political and mm -hmm. um, it's I, I wondered how, how did you get it and how long did it take to, to get to all the um, material material for that uh, well uh, since Uh, I'm doing the film for for a longer time. Uh, I have uh, also an archive uh, mm -hmm. of of scenes which I have never used. So this this is one thing. But but in general, the film was shot. Uh, 2017 started. 
Yeah, mm. it started, started 2017 and it was finished. 2020. 2020. So <laughs> four years. Fuck. Four years. Time, you know. And uh, yeah. So this is this this is it. And uh, so uh, and the shooting is. Sorry, what was the question? I don't want to just uh, make a folk around myself. How long and how long did it take? And how do you get the different materials from it? Because I, I, there are so so animals. There are the performance group. There are these experts and everything. And it's very. Yeah. Um, and so, so well, the the key to the film for, for me, well, in general, for me, the film is not so is less about time. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more as a field. So it, it is for describing the film. And when I think about the film, it is more like a, uh, how to say spatial metaphor, not a time based metaphor. So when I start to doing films, I, I can bring it uh, um, maybe while well, next question when Ashbeta will be speaking, I have pictures and these are like the collages or, or, or the paintings and things like this or, or the diagrams and it started like this. That I have some kind of like preconception which I put in the paper and then uh, I start to shoot it. So it is like more or less like this or and there is like another part of and it is, it is like lesser part of mm -hmm. some kind of uh, things which i find at the period quite acute for example i don't know what but that could be example <laughs> I, I would try to summarize it it's mostly yeah. about uh, somehow the connection of the age of ours which we are something between 30 and 40 which you start to facing some questions you know then it's about like uh, things you are seeing around yourself. Usually Andre also is having a camera everywhere he goes. So when he, you know, like sees something interesting and he traveled a lot that time, we were filming in France, we were filming in Russia, uh, in Czech Republic, in Romania. in Romania. So there are a lot of like uh, shots from different countries. Um, some of them are planned in, uh, as for example, this cannibalistic ritual. Some of them are just not really random, but he just sees something very interesting, you know, he, and he's got an idea, it could fit in the movie, so he started to shoot it. So we basically had some script, I would say, but it was like, you know, as a documentary on experimental movie in one, it's script slash like uh, situations going around you, which which we were, we had some time plan. We also, it was also connected a little bit with the financing as well, because it was from the beginning a little bit uh, difficult to finance that movie because, you know, to pitch this idea to the people was not easy, but we made it. So I would say it's it's like a, all of these things together. Mm -hmm. And what was your part on, on the, um, big, uh, so in the team or how did you, Help him, or help him or as a producer everybody would say firstly the money of course but uh, also i would say i was the um also like a creative producer you know we were talking a lot about the things we also were part of the doc incubator when we had a lot of like feedback from different editors or producers of documentary movies so i would say we were like um i was producing the movie but also uh, i was a lot of like um in, contact, in touch with him and we discussed all the topics and what could be in and could be not a lot of mostly it's his ideas of course but I was like giving his feedback and talking about uh, if it fits or not because you know he has a really creative mind so kind of like squeeze it in like 62 minutes was, mm -hmm. was very harsh <laughs> okay. there's a lot of material which is not used actually yeah, because I was I was thinking when I see this this um, I was not sure if this is more or less a collective work in a way um, or if you as a director um, plan everything and say everything or are there more people like in the credits there are a long, long list of people um, mm -hmm. and uh, and your film is also about um, about about Marx and capitalism and something like that. There's so much in it and has something to do also with, with power and yeah. do something. And as you as a director and with the team, um, for me it was very interesting how this works together with the ideas um, you have or they, they have. Was it a collective work or is it more or less you? Well, uh, I think it, it is, uh, I would love to be collective. But it is. Uh, but since it is documentary, there is there is there is a lot of 
inputs of, of another person. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, like the, how to say, the turning point is me. Unfortunately, you know, unfortunately, <laughs> I would I, I would love to, for example, create the group Ziga Verko, Vertov 2, you know, which, yeah. uh, which was created yes. in, in 70s to, to a little yeah. bit dissolve the idea of authorship. Mm -hmm. But uh, it, it didn't work. But well, <laughs> I just didn't try to make maybe too much. But uh, this, this kind of collective thinking and uh, is would be nice. And secondly, to the, to, to the collectivity of the film, there is a person, if you have noticed, well, I'm sure, it's, it's, a, it's a hat, you know. It's mm -hmm. a, yeah, I know, like invisible, Apply, uh, invisible yeah. market, uh, hands yeah. of market, I guess. The invisible. Yeah, yeah, and, and so, and, and there is also the hat which, who, is, who is walking yeah. and so on. And so I was, I was thinking about shooting uh, the film about everyone, you know, about, about Yedemen, Yedemen, or the, uh, how, 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 how you say it. And so this is also the collectivity of the audience because the film is about, like in general, about world, or it's about yourself. It's it's about all the collective of yourselves. Let's put it like all the that. collectives of myself. Yeah, of, of 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 all. It's about all the people, you know, because yeah. because the world itself and, and the topic of the holes is concerned of all of us, you know. And that's yeah, and why I, there is like the invisible person, you know, which is going to be the market and so on. But this is like the void person, you know. Yeah, but mostly if, if we were asking, it's his work, but he's surrounded by a lot of people. I would say the editor, Anička Petrožilová, I did a lot of ideas into the movie as well, but everything which was shot, is free. It, it just comes from his head mostly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, because I was because what you just said about all the people in the world and how they're living and about um, being in a different in, a, in an age in a special one and I think it's it's very um, it it really fits to the kind of form you you choose that you take um, uh, experimental ones then music in between then stop motion everything um, and as well to the eight millimeter um, um, material. Okay. Hmm? 16, 16 millimeters, sorry, mm -hmm. yeah, you know, but the film material yeah. and that, yeah. And uh, you know, you know what? Because this film doesn't uh, doesn't work uh, as uh, uh, it is a little bit like a itching, you know, uh, because uh, itching. I, I I think you know when when you are the the Chinese uh, art of uh, uh, writing, no. No, I don't understand either. I, I, <laughs> it's I I T I N G. I, I, aging. What does it yeah, mean? The, I don't know. It is, it, <laughs> it, is, it, is it, it is the way how to foresee the future. Okay. And all the, all the horoscopes are working like this as well, you know, because half of the film is like there at the film. It is on the screen, and it is it is the sound which is there, which is like fixed. And uh, half of the, uh, is yeah. it is in your head. Mm. In other words, you have to be active. You mm. have to contribute to the film. You have to search your own path by the film. And if you mm. if you, you have so, so your contribution is your film. So everyone sees very different films, uh, and uh, you, you know what I mean. So so this kind I, of. I yeah. totally know what you mean. I I to, um, totally think that that's very important to. Me. To 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 um, to say okay the the um, if you watch it it's it's everyone watch a different film maybe some yeah. some some do um, or understand some things in the other way or not and so I yeah, really yeah. like the moment when you say I think it's about forty five minutes when you say and if you don't understand it the film it's okay <laughs> yeah, yeah 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 because it's like um, freeing you as a filmmaker as well as like the audience to to see something and sometimes to think okay no i don't get that <laughs> but then yeah. next or um, c come in at another moment and say okay but that that really makes something with me or i learned something right now so, yeah yeah yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm glad that, that 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 you pointed up this moment because it's i think it's really okay when we don't understand in general you know. yeah that's that's also in the whole I, I mean you start with that if you say we don't have 100 percent knowledge that's for sure this way everything is not really yeah. stable and there i could say because there's one point where i in your film i get this moment where i was thinking okay but but and that's the end 
I'm a little bit the, the editing and then the end. And I was thinking about, did you have the end in mind from the, from the starting point? Because I think it's a, a very, I, I don't know, a, a very, no, romantic is not wrong, but, but I was thinking, okay, they, there you close the film in a way. Yeah, yeah, it is, it, it is a romantic, yeah. But, but, yeah. yeah. It is difficult to answer the question, you know, like, kind of like we were really having a struggle from the beginning, like, uh, if you're facing the different holes, everybody has some holes uh, in his thinking, in his feelings around himself or herself. Mm. So how to, how to f actually, f I don't want to say what is it about, right? Because I don't know if the yeah. people see the discussion before or after, but to get some reasonable conclusion, kind of that everybody at least understands what we are thinking and talking about. Mm -hmm. I think this is the only way how you can Grasp live, it. Yeah. live with the holes <laughs> around yourself because they will not disappear. Will exist. Yeah, and I like the end, but on the other way, I was thinking, okay, maybe, maybe there you, you, I was this this whole web of your film, and then in the end, I have the solution which I like and and love, uh, but it's it's a little bit closing the film, and I was thinking because you're coming from editing in a way, um, did yeah. you edit? Who edited the film? We edited in the in the couple with uh, with with my friend and and Benjamin was helping, so kind of like two and a half people. Yeah. <laughs> because it has was a lot of material, wasn't it? I think when you yes. know, three yes, four it was years. A lot of material. Well, well, which is it, it, it was it was really funny. It was it was very nice thing when when uh, the, when we were in the incubator discussions, you know, there was mm -hmm. a catalog, you know, thick catalog, you know, and there were like I don't know eight projects, seven projects, something like this. And there was the information about budget, da, 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 bios, and so on. And also the hours of shot, shot material, you know. So people were there like 100 hours, or 120, 80 hours, you know. And we had eight hours. We have just eight hours. Okay, of just eight hours. Yeah, but it's but it's it, it's a lot in, in a way, you know. <laughs> There's a lot of editing. We don't have like a really long scenes when the people, you know, when you're observing some situation, like, you know, you just have like a lot of editing in there. And we really had made like, I don't know, maybe even 10 versions before we yeah. get to the end with, and there was a lot of like uh, moving from different, you know, the, the structure of the film was changing a lot during this doc incubator because um, we just kind of try to not, uh, it's, this is not film for everybody, let's be honest, this is not for everybody around ourselves, but for people who really like, like to think about it and really like to observe and, still we would like to give the keys you know to the people how to open the different parts of the film that maybe they don't understand everything but they are still on the track we were a little bit problems at the beginning having with the uh, understanding and with some tempo of the film you know mm. some the flow but it's just okay this is sort of normal yeah. but there, there were this eight hours and archive archive material isn't it or was it well it was but it was i just uh, i with uh, with with anna who, who helped me with editing um, mostly uh, we just saw my uh, i just showed her some my older material and but yeah. it wasn't it wasn't much you know so okay. like to say of the raw material also with archive it would be like maybe i don't know 11 hours mm -hmm. so, you know, we're shooting yeah. on a film. We were not digital. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's true. Yeah. So, so, but, but the editing process was uh, quite um, demanding, quite long. You know, mm -hmm. but it was, it was like the to see to to find the right combinatorics from the material. Mm -hmm. So it was like combinatory work. You know. Mm -hmm. Okay. And trying to <laughs> search, as as Ashbeta said, the flow. Like the flow was 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 very important. What's important, yeah. Yeah, um, yeah. and and who, the music were what? From whom is that? Who did this? And what was the? Well, the the, the music is from I don't know from uh, <laughs> a school of uh, from Paris from 11th century, mm -hmm. and then uh, it's Antonin Dvořák, the Czech world famous composer, then uh, Shostakovich, Russian composer. Then uh, my song, uh, my songs. Then and then uh, I have a friend. Uh, that are your songs because I, I think 
Uh, yeah, and, 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 and they are like uh, new songs or new music. Mm -hmm. Composed. Mm -hmm. yeah, Composed by, by a composer. Yeah, so because I like the mixture of, of the classical stuff somehow and then the, yeah, yeah, the yeah, new yeah. ones in between. And also I um, was thinking about um, the, the experts you have in your film. So uh -huh. all, all, all different kinds of physicians, philosophers, economists, theologists, ethnologists, and mu musicologists, I don't know, <laughs> but really a lot of experts. Um, and while I was seeing, uh, watching the film, I was thinking, I, I like them, and you put them, where did you put them and why? And what do you think about experts, <laughs> in a way? Well, um, I, I, I would put it, I put it like this. Because I, in the beginning, I wanted to do a feature film, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, well, more, it, that it would be more feature. So, for example, there, there, there is a girl with curly hair, and I, I like some um, uh, thoughts by Anika Susenel, who is the French theologist. And mm -hmm. so, so I tell you, so just tell this and tell this, and we will how to uh, we will stage it. And then it wasn't it, it, it wasn't good at all, and I said, well, but. Why didn't I call her the, th the French theologist? So I just called her <laughs> and she was, because she's now like 94 and I, I thought that she, she's, she's already in, in another world and she's not here with us, but she is. So mm -hmm. I just went to France and th that was it, you know. So, so uh, I, I'm searching for, uh, there are some ideas which, which, uh, which, I, which are interesting for me or which are, crucial for me and then I then I search for the expert we, who can with which I can talk and with which mm -hmm. we can consider the thoughts which are important for me so mm -hmm. this, this was this is the selection of the of, of the experts you know because the experts I just I just know it from my personal need but then but they they are occupying their sem, themselves like professionally by by these thoughts so mm -hmm. you know these are the like uh, friends in, uh, in, in ideas. Yeah, that's nice because I only um, choose this term of experts because in documentaries you have a lot of experts somehow, but you, you break, broke, broke it, break it in a way that you think, okay, that's more like friends. I'm going over the street, I'm going in the tram with them, or they're standing in front of Trojak's house or something like yeah. that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's, I, I think, uh, I don't like much that. Uh, Sometimes the experts in, in documentary films, they are like a cows, you know, they just give you, <laughs> just, they just stand there and you just milk them and they, they, they give you what, what you need. But, but what okay. I prefer is to spend the time with them and, and see what they like and, and make the shooting as comfortable as for me, as for them, you know, and just to uh, enjoy it, you know, to have a fun yeah. from shooting and this, this fun of having uh, camera to my, with, with myself and sound, you know, of, of editing. This is like the thing which is uh, for me like crucial as well, just to mm -hmm. enjoy you know, and yeah. to pass the joy, you know, to pass the joy. Yeah, yeah if, if, for me it works. <laughs> I enjoy the two. We are glad. Yeah. And what's it in your back? Um, what we, could we see there? Are you doing this artwork? Yes, yes, yes. And, and it was, it was um, also in, in, in the film. Mm -hmm. and, it, and it is made of the uh, trash, you know, mm -hmm. and especially it's it's a trash of alcohol, you know, uh, yeah. bottles of of, 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 of bottles. <laughs> of the, um, yeah, exactly. Yeah. How to openers, say? bottle openers. <laughs> yeah. So, for example, this this rim, uh, you don't see it, but uh, for example, this rim is mm -hmm. made of the when you have the bush. How to say it? You you, are, you have the wine which you are opening like this, you know. Yeah, no. this this is made of of caps of of it, you know. This is from the wine bottles mostly. Yeah. And it's so nice that it's now an icona, so something Christian. So because that's also religion is also in your film. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, it's, so it's, much. It's, it's, yeah. it's also a, a, yeah a part of and, the struggle. And, yeah. Yeah, and also I was thinking with the closing thing that something to to um, make holes to 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 close them and then you break them up and do something. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, and um, you can find in everything you you or a lot of things are more have no more more meanings mm -hmm. in different parts, and that's very very interesting. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, because then I think we're at the end. 
or do you have to say something or is there something you want to I don't know greet something? yes 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 I would like to say yeah 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 I, yes yes I, I, uh, I would like to say that um, uh, that the film this film or I think the film in general uh, it will be nice that it just passes the joy as I said and mm -hmm. for passing the joy and in film and in life as well is good to be open to the situation that's why mm -hmm. we have the theory about uh, Rui Althusser, the, the, the philosophy of encounter so just be open open your hearts your ears and eyes and, and nasal, na nasal holes you know <laughs> and this hole and, and everything just mm -hmm. open yourself and say wow this is it <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, because that was because you were speaking of joy. It was like this um, to, to watch the movie for me. I watched it twice and I think I could watch it over and over again. It's not only that there's joy in it, but also that I think this I, I could think and this intellectual and it's something yeah, in yeah, yeah, between yeah. between feeling and um, the head and that I like very much. Yeah, because this, this is this, this is the concept uh, when uh, Nietzsche, he, he, has the, he has the book which is called Gaia Scientia, the, the joyful science, you know. Mm -hmm. And I think that this kind of, of, of joyful science, of joyful intellectualism or of joyful thinking, you know. Yes. I, th yeah. I think that for film for this, uh, I don't see it very often, but film mm -hmm. for this is like extremely fitting medium, you know. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. it, it can be it can be verbal, but it, there can be thinking. But since it's all the time something which is visual, something which is tactile, you know, it's it mm -hmm. it's it has this quality of the joy, you know. So jo yeah. like the Gaia Scientia, the joyful science is the is the how to say the key concept which I like in my films in general. Oh, yeah. yeah, great. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so thank you very much.